Hi, my name is Walter. I'm in third grade and I'm in Ms. Bryant's class. And for my GT project, I was studying the different physical properties of the rocks in my collection. And I learned three ways to test that. The hardness test, the magnetism test, and the acid test. And the first test I did was the magnetism test, which were you try to pick up a rock with a magnet, and if it is picked up, then it's magnetic. So first I used I did this rock. And it wasn't picked up. And then I did this rock and it was picked up. So this is probably not the type. And then I, I learned about the hardness test. And the hardness test is where you like say I, I think I have calcite and I wanna and I wanna scratch it with a fingernail and a penny. A fingernail has a hardness of two point five and a penny has a hardness of three point five. One being the least and ten being the uh, greatest of this. And I scratched it with a fingernail, and it wasn't scratched. And then I scratched it with a penny, and that was scratched. So it's a hardness of around, which means it's a, my rock is a hardness of around three. So it might be calcite. But how can I confirm that it's calcite? Because that's not calcite isn't the only rock that. Um, that is scratch that it that is a hardness of three. I can do the acid test. So the acid test is where you get a an acid, I use vinegar, which is a weak acid, and you um, put a drop of that acid on your rock, and if it fizzes, then it has calcium carbonate in it, and and I know that because calcium carbonate is unstable in the presence of acid. So I had this rock that I just tested with, and I had another rock that looked just like it, and I wanted to know which one was calcite. So, like, which one might be calcite. So, I put each one in the acid, and this one ended up fizzing. So, this is going to be calcite. And that was my GT project.